Hi guys! Today we will be making these Harry Potter inspired miniature doll sweets. This video is a collaboration with three other crafters on the theme sweets. I've been pretty busy pre-recording videos for something later this year, you'll see when we get there, wink wink. But when this collaboration came up, the both theme and timing was perfect for me, so I was able to participate, which is really awesome. So first off in the collaboration, we have Kim from Kimspire DIY. She chose to make candy phone cases and chargers. Next up is Jackie, aka Nudie Crafter. She did this gummy worm phone case that can actually glow in the dark. And finally, Sarah from So Craftastic, and she's showing how you can paint with actual Skittles. If you haven't seen these lovely ladies before, you should definitely go and get acquainted, so go check out their channels. The link will be in the info box for both their channels and their videos. Now let's get to my part. Firstly, I went online and studied the packaging. You can find pretty good stencils to figure out the shapes. Then I traced both patterns onto some thick sketchbook paper and I used an X-Acto knife to cut up the open spaces in the Bertie Bots box. To paint the boxes, I used watercolor pencils, using them both dry and wet on a brush. If you guys want a quicker and easier solution, you can find packaging online that you can print them the size you want them. I enjoy painting packages like this, so I like to do it myself. And if you want to practice your drawing skills, this is a good opportunity. I also made a little wizard card to go inside the box with the chocolate frog. Since I don't have magical powers to make a moving image of a wizard, I went for a more cartoony style, which you found in the first Harry Potter games to the PC, which I used to play. Thank you. 
cut out the card and then paint the back side. Seal it all with a fixative or hairspray to keep it from smudging. Then cut out the boxes and glue them together with a glue stick. I ended up removing the flaps I'd previously made for the Birchie Butts box, simply because I didn't really need them. Then I made a small plastic bag to hold the beans, by taking the corner of a small Ziploc bag and simply gluing one side. To make the beans, get out some small pieces of Colma clay in different colors. I mixed a bit of translucent into mine. Then you want to roll them into small snakes. Cut equal pieces and then roll up the chubby little bean shapes. Do this for all your colors and then bake them according to package instructions. Once cool, you're ready to put the little beans into the bag and place them into the box. Next we're gonna make the chocolate frog. Flatten a small ball of brown polymer clay, and then I use my basic sculpting tools and my X-Acto knife to shape it. Once you're happy with the look of your frog, bake that as well. I decided to add some highlights with some light brown acrylic paint before sealing it in with a glaze. And that's a Harry Potter inspired sweets done. I hope you enjoyed this sweets inspired video and the rest of the collaboration. Be sure you head over to the others and their videos and show them some love. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in a new video real soon. Bye!